Welcome back everyone. In this episode we're going to travel along the Anna Branch Mail Road in the lower western part of New South Wales. Stick around. We're only looking at a small section of the Anna Branch and the Anna Branch Mail Road today. Um, we're going to start here at the Wentworth Renmark Road and then we're going to reconnect with the Silver City Highway at the Bunurundji Bridge, all up about 70 kilometres of the Mail Road. Our first stop is here, the 10 Mile Bridge. We're only a couple of kilometres from where the Anna Branch joins up with the Murray River, so if you're a keen kayaker, this is a great spot to launch from. The original 10 Mile Bridge seen here was built in 1867, making it 157 years old. Even though it's now closed, it's actually in pretty good nick for its age. Uh, it was upgraded in 1895 and again in the mid-1900s, and the new bridge was built in 2003. Now the old mail road passes through private farmland, so be extremely respectful to the landowners. Hunting and camping without permission or taking dogs would be a big no-no. Next stop, the Anna Branch Hall. The road's actually in pretty good nick. Um, there's only a handful of spots you'll see the Anna Branch along this road, but there is plenty of wildlife and it is really worth the drive. You'll see stacks of me and ewes like these ones here, as well as kangaroos, lizards and all sorts of things, so it really is a, a, a bit of an adventure. We'll keep cruising along. A bit of a history lesson. So the outer branch of the Darling River is the ancient riverbed of the Darling River, so the original Darling River, until it changed its course around 11,000 years ago. It's commonly referred to as the Great Darling Anna Branch, or simply the Darling Anna Branch. A bit of a sneak peek of the river. Um, I've got to stress, do not drive off the roads here. This is private property. So we've just parked on the side of the road and we've walked about 10, 15 metres to have a quick look. Um, be respectful, don't drive off the roads. The Anna Branch Hall, let's have a look around. The Anna Branch Hall provided a vital uh, venue for social interactions for people living in the isolated Anna Branch district back in the day. Uh, dances and sports days were held here and, and they still have the annual Anna Branch picnic here. The Anna Branch Hall is available to the public for functions and gatherings and it can be booked through the Wentworth Cancel. It's pretty affordable and um, up to date pricing can be found on the Wentworth Shire Cancel webpage and I'll put a link to that in the description. Flows into the Anna Branch are, are pretty inconsistent so a quick Google before you travel is a good idea. Generally speaking the Anna Branch receives flows when the Darling River reaches 6 metres or 10,000 megalitres a day. Uh, it also receives uh, regulated flows from the Menindee Lakes. Uh, we did a, a video on the Menindee Lakes just recently, so have a look through my playlist and you'll find that one. Uh, it's full of water at the moment. On to the Bunurundji Bridge. Just pulled over onto the side of the road and look what we have here. G'day mate, what are you doing? A little uh, frill neck or bearded dragon or whatever you want to call them. We've made it back to the Silver City Highway, so it's about 70 k's to Wentworth from here. We'll have a look at the Bunurundji Bridge and the Anna Branch there um, before we call it quits. Not much left to do other than throw a chop on the barbie. Well there you have it guys, the uh, Anna Branch Mail Road. It's about a 70 kilometre stretch of road, um, but if you like this video, stick this one out here, uh, Yabby in on the Darling River. Be good, stay safe and bye for now.